How's the market been in the last month? Hot. <laughs> How could this be during a pandemic? Hi, Gary Sarah here with Remax. Let's take a look at the July 2020 market stats for more insight on this. Believe it or not, in July, home sale and listing activity exceeded historical levels. On the demand side, there were more than 3,100 homes sold in July, a 28% increase over June and a 22% increase over this time last year. On the supply side, we saw close to 6,000 new homes listed in July. This represents a 2.8% increase over June and almost 30% increase over this time last year. This brings the total listing supply to 12,083 homes. Why is this happening? Three reasons. One, historically low mortgage interest rates. Two, the pent up demand from the paused busy spring market prior to the lockdown. And three, buyers and sellers feeling more comfortable and confident in today's market. To the supply and demand in our market, we look to the sales to active listings ratio. The balance is what determines price fluctuations. When this ratio dips below 12%, prices typically decline. If it goes above 20%, it puts us in a seller's market. Right now, we are sitting at almost 26%, which obviously is a seller's market as a whole. By property type, the ratio is 25.1% for detached homes, 31.1% for townhomes, and 24.7% for condos. The benchmark price for all residential properties is currently sitting at 1031400 This represents a 4.5% increase over this time last year and a 0.9% increase over last month. Does this seem like the right time to get into the market, move up, or cash out? Let's have a coffee on me and chat.